Hey guys, it's Albert from Muffin Group. In today's tutorial, I would like to present new option we released with version 27.1, which you've been asking for so much. I mean converting an already existing sections to a global ones. I know that many of you have been eagerly waiting for this feature, so without extending this introduction, let's get to the specifics. Let's say we already built page with many different sections and among these sections there is one or maybe more that we want to have in other places, maybe on other pages, and we do not want to lose the time to build it from scratch as a global section. By the way, if you didn't watch my video regarding global wraps and sections yet, I will leave you the link to the tutorial in the left top corner but also in the description down there below so you can watch it anytime. This is where the option to convert an existing section to a global section comes in handy. The whole process is extremely easy and would take just a few seconds, what I'm going to show you right now. To convert section to a global one, just right click on the section you want to convert and choose convert to global option or hover over the icon in the upper right corner of the section, these three vertical dots and choose convert to global. After clicking, a window will pop up where we need to enter a name for this section. Let's name it My Test Section and let's click Save button. At this point, the section we converted to Global Section will change to a global one, which you can see by this light green overlay color when hovering over the section. From now on, if you want to make changes in this section, we have to click on Edit Global Section icon and we will be taken to the editing page of this section. We can go back to the WordPress admin now and by going to templates, we are gonna see our global section on the list where from we can edit it, remove, etc. If now we want to use that section on page, all we have to do is choose that section from the list of global sections while adding the content. What's more, if for some reason we decide that we wanted to insert different global section we can easily change it by clicking on edit button and choosing another global section from the list. It's that simple. So as you can see, converting a section to a global section has been simplified as much as possible. I personally like this option very much and will be definitely using it. I hope you will enjoy it sometime too. If you like this video, I encourage you to watch another video where I explain how to use global sections and wraps. And as always, thanks for watching and remember to like, subscribe and hit the bell icon to get notified every time we release a new video. And if you have more questions, please visit our support center at support.muffingroup.com.